Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Mohit and you're watching Techstra. Apple has released its latest version of iOS and we now have iOS 15.4.1 that is currently available to download if you haven't seen the update notification already as this got released on 31st of March 2022. This release came in a little under three weeks after the big release of iOS 15.4. With this release, we got updates for iOS, iPadOS, watchOS, macOS, tvOS, and HomePodOS. Now, 15.4 was one of the biggest updates, packed with features. However, some users on their iPhones and on their iPads had reported battery drain issues. The latest release, 15.4.1, is all about bug fixes. And thankfully, it resolved the battery drain problem on the iPhones and on the iPads, and also provided the fix for the hearing aids and provided some updates about Braille devices. In this video, I will be covering about what you should know about Apple's latest iOS update by highlighting seven biggest and amazing features of iOS 15.4. This operating system update brings AirTag anti-stalking alerts, a general neutral voice option for Siri, new emoji, super cool universal control, and the long-awaited update to the Face ID that now has the capability to unlock your iPhone even with a mask. As per the version naming convention, iOS 15.4 is the fourth major update to the iOS 15. The previous version was launched in January this year to patch a security vulnerability in iPhones and iPads. It's now time to take a deep dive into the amazing features of iOS 15.4 one by one. The first biggest update is the universal control. We've been waiting for this feature since quite some time now, and thankfully, Apple has given a pleasant surprise to make this feature go live. Universal control lets you use other Apple devices as secondary screens to move content between them seamlessly. This eagerly anticipated feature was initially announced with Mac OS Monterey. However, it was delayed, and then the new timeline was released. For this to be operational, both devices must be signed into iCloud using the same Apple ID using two-factor authentication. To connect wirelessly, both devices must have Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and handoff turned on and should be within 10 meters of range. The second biggest update is with the Face ID technology. Apple has updated its Face ID feature to be usable on iPhone 12 or newer models, even while wearing a mask. Because the feature uses a smaller portion of your face to verify the identity, you need to be more precise about the angle you're holding your phone at while using the Face ID. Your phone will even prompt you if it needs you to look more directly at the screen. The updated feature should work for people who wear glasses, but it won't work with sunglasses. If you've ever tried to unlock your iPhone or use Apple Pay with a mask on, you know that it's pretty much impossible. Usually, you have to either manually type in your passcode or pull your mask down under your chin, but those days are over. As long as you have an iPhone 12 or later running iOS 15.4, you can easily go into your phone's settings and toggle on the new settings, which uses the features around your eyes to authenticate it's really you, even with a mask on. This is another feather in the cap for machine learning and artificial intelligence. The third biggest update is with the introduction of new emojis. So if you love utilizing funny and creative emojis, then you're going to love iOS 15.4. There are around 37 new emojis. So go out there and start exploring and expressing in a new fashion with your loved ones. Fourth biggest update brings in the safety focus updates to AirTags, which have been under the spotlight after reports of devices being used to stalk people. Apple has reportedly introduced new measures of anti-stalking features in this latest release. When setting up an AirTag with iOS 15.4, you'll now receive a clear notification that your AirTag is meant only to track your own belongings and it's linked to your Apple ID, essentially warning you that if you attempt to use it to stalk someone, the AirTag can be linked back to you. The notification also states that using the AirTag to track someone in this manner is considered a crime. Fifth biggest update changes the emergency call shortcut. Call with five presses from a default setting to an option meaning the feature won't be enabled unless you choose to allow it. The hold and press option for the side and volume buttons remains enabled by default. Sixth biggest update is called as SharePlay. Staying in touch with your friends and family these days is more essential than ever before. 
with SharePlay, you can watch together, listen together, and share your screen using FaceTime. FaceTime with this latest release also sound and feel more natural. With families living far across the world, it's a beautiful and meaningful way to watch some of your favorite shows and movies together. I must say, technology is bringing in lives together and we can do so much together. Last but not the least is another feature and our seventh biggest gift included in this update and it's the ability to copy text from any object using the camera app, what in the notes or reminders app, making it absolutely convenient and easier on how we do our daily tasks while taking some notes. All right, so this was a quick video about the tech-oriented power-packed features that Apple has introduced in its latest software release, iOS 15.4. I hope this has been informative for you and I'd like to thank you for watching. For more technology and product updates, please like this video and subscribe to my channel, Tech Strya.